From discovering new drugs to treat the most damaging of diseases to finding new ways to connect rural communities to health services. Health research has a lot of benefits for this country, but a recent study published in the South African Medical Journal found that health funding for research is quite short for where it should be. To discuss the issue, I have Bongani Mayosi here from the head of the Department of Medicine at the University of Cape Town. Welcome. Thank you very much. Now, you were one of the authors on this article that found that health funding is, uh, for, for research specifically, is falling short for targets. Can you explain a little bit about what those targets are and how uh, you calculated that shortfall? Yes. No, thank you for this opportunity. Uh, we wrote a paper in the South African Medical Journal, and we wrote it as part of a group called the National Health Research Committee. This is a committee appointed by the Minister of Health to advise the South African government on priorities for health research. When we started this work, we identified that South Africa was not spending enough on health research. Um, there are various uh, uh, criteria that are used to determine the amount of money that should be spent on health research. And one of those is the proportion of the budget of the Department of Health that's actually spent on health research. Because the Department of Health obviously looks after the health of the country, must pay for drugs, must pay for staff, must pay for buildings. But in addition to that, they must actually also pay for health research because health research is essential. And one of the numbers that are used internationally is that a Department of Health should probably spend about 2% of its budget, a minimum of 2% of its budget, on health research. In this study, we uh, worked out that the budget of the Department of Health is about a hundred billion rand. And 2% of a hundred billion should be two billion rand. Mm -hmm. But in fact, when we looked at the number that the Department was uh, spending through Parliament, it was 400 million rand, which is far short of what is needed. And this is one of the reasons South Africa is not doing as well as it should in the generation of the knowledge that's required to solve the health prob problems that exist.